Well, here we are the second video and uh, uh, I thought I was going to take this and set this up at work initially but I thought that would be pretty dumb so what I've done is set it up at home and to start out I've used uh, this live sand the rib sea ocean direct live sand never used it before so uh, hope all goes well um, but there's one of the thing one thing that I wanted to point out about this tank is that down in the bottom there are two inlets there's one up here and then one down there and as you can see it kind of makes it difficult to have a fairly decent uh, size sand bed so what I did was two things see these uh, coral rocks here I took and put in front of the inlet and then on the inside I put some gravel some crushed uh, crushed coral actually down there to try and keep sand from getting sucked into the inlet down there too much. So what I did was there's about I don't know half an inch behind this white wall here uh, where that bottom inlet is. There's about a half inch of rock to just have a narrow inlet and allow enough water from the bottom of the tank to get sucked in along with what comes in from the top inlet. So that, again, we don't get sand, you know, sucked into the filtration system. I'm trying to prevent that as best as possible. But so far, the lighting is fairly decent. You know, it's red, blue, and white LEDs. Three switches. Turn them all off and on. And one, another thing that I didn't really like about this tank is, in there, there are two glass pieces. One on each side of that pump. And I don't know if you can see it, but it looks like they didn't even use like a glass cutter to uh, to cut it. It looks like they just broke it. So that's kind of kind of crappy craftsmanship if you ask me. But I mean, you know, again, the overall tank, I'm, I'm, I like the style. Um, and again, it was a Christmas gift. My wife got it for me. And I really like it. Um, I like the tank a lot. And that's a side view, really. I'm just going to do some uh, Zoas and uh, some shrimp or Crabs, probably crabs, since it's a three gallon, supposedly three gallon. I think it's really like two and a half gallons. Cause I filled, I did a leak test with it, and it barely took a little over two gallons uh, to fill this thing up. So, again, this is the uh, JBJ QB, well, mini QB LED uh, Pico system. Got it from uh, Marine Depot. Uh, that was on the, uh, uh, not really the receipt. I forget what you call it. Uh, contents letter or whatever the hell it's called but anyway uh came from uh, marine depot uh, i saw it online it was about 110 bucks before christmas and after christmas the freaking thing went on sale for 90 bucks well 89 dollars and uh and my wife kind of got shafted out of a couple dollars there but i still appreciate the gift really like it i think it's a cool tank and we'll keep uh updating the we'll keep the videos updated with the progress